Hey, we're here in uh, beautiful downtown Santa Ana with Evans Brassfield. Uh, we've got new Indian Scout 60. It's just like the bigger Indian Scout, but um, 60 cubic inches instead of 69 cubic inches, like the bigger one. It's got one less speed in the transmission. I don't really miss it. And uh, the biggest thing is it's quite a bit less expensive than the bigger one, pretty cheap. So we got the, got the new Harley Davidson Iron 883 also which is like $150 less than the Scout. We put them both on the scales. They both weigh 565 pounds. Uh, and we're gonna ride both these bikes up north a little bit. I think we're gonna call it the, uh, the, the Make America Great Again Cruise Off. So we got two Great American motorcycles. What's, that's such a long name. Should we change it to Make America Cruise Again? And we could call it that too. Well, since I spent an hour, over an hour, splitting lanes down here this morning since we're shooting in, in your neighborhood yeah. uh, and I haven't had a chance to throw a leg over the, the Scout 60. I'd love to get a chance to, to swap out with you. Should we mix it up a little bit? Should we ride both bikes? Sure, why not? Let's call it a comparison. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. That was pretty darn fun. That was pre pretty fun, not bad, huh? Had a pretty good ride from the halls of Santa Ana to the shores of Trump National Golf Course. And we left our mark on some of those corners. Which of these do you, you, you think going to take the overall honors? You like the I, Scout? I like the Scout 60. It's everything um, I liked about the Scout, but less. You know, a little less horsepower, a little less displacement, definitely less shifting because there's only five speeds. There's only five speeds. But a lot of the things I absolutely loved about it is still the same. The, the attitude, the riding position, the way it carries its weight, um, even the handling. You know, switching back and forth in these though, um, I gotta say, the last time I, I, I got on the Iron 883, I was thinking, you know, I do like the flickability of this. It turns in a little quicker, it feels a little more nimble, but uh, then I dragged the, the pipe and the whole bike gave me a, a big shake and I thought, uh, no, I... Yeah, yeah. I have to say, I really like the way that thing looks. You know, and the, the absence of a radiator, it's still air-cooled, it's, kind, yep. of, it's ca kind of primitive compared to the, the liquid-cooled Indian, it doesn't make as much horsepower. But um, for the kind of riding we were doing today, where we didn't ever get going faster than 80 on the freeway, you don't really miss the power that much, do you? That thing feels like just as spunky around town as the Indian does, but if you're going cross-country or something, you want the extra power of the Indian. and. Uh, and this one has ABS. So it is one of the things we've dinged oh, yeah. the sports on before, but it has ABS. The Indian does not have ABS, right? Not, it's not available as an option. I guess one of the things I want to talk about on the Sportster is I think Harley knows that there are people that want to go fast because I just spent time on the Roadster, which is a Sportster with 0.7 inch more travel and a larger diameter rear tire. And if this bike had that, 
it would transform it. But I think if it was me, I'd, I'd, I'd rather prefer I, this. I like the initials, the original Scout when it came out, and so I figured I would like this one since the only thing that really changed is, is the displacement, the transmission, and some of the uh, fit and finish type stuff. And so I, I went in here thinking that I would, I would like it because I enjoyed the Scout so much. And what do you know, I was right. But I think we've already picked the Scouts that are going to win this one up. I think so. It's got more power, it's a more refined package, it's a really nice, stronger brakes, it's, not, it's a nice motorcycle. But uh, that doesn't mean that you shouldn't go to Motorcycle.com to read the whole story anyway, because I'm, I'm going to have to write it, somebody better, better read it. Alright, Motorcycle.com. Go there. <laughs>